And welcome back to Most Buffalo. So if you need something to take your mind off of the Bills being out of the playoffs, how about the Summer Olympic Games? Come July, we could be following several local athletes on their quest for gold. As Lauren Hall tells us, there are both familiar faces and some newcomers. Hey, Kate, we are just 200 days away from the 2020 Summer Olympics in Tokyo. Opening ceremonies begin on July 24th, and we just wanted to check up on some of our local Olympic hopefuls, starting with West Seneca native Matt Anderson. He's a member of the U.S. National Volleyball Team, which has already qualified for the Games, and Anderson is expected to make that final roster. Team USA is looking for a little revenge this year. They took home bronze in Rio. Also expected to be on the qualifying team is Nichols alum rower Emily Regan. Her eight woman boat won third in the world championships and a slot in the Olympics. And she is looking to get her second consecutive Olympic gold medal. And in pole vault, Fredonia native Jen Schur broke her retirement to make one last Olympic run. She medaled in London and Beijing and is expected to compete in the Olympic trials this summer. Also hoping to qualify this spring is Anita Alvarez. The synchronized swimmer competed in Rio but didn't medal. And finally, a newcomer, Brian Err. He's from Western New York and he's one of the top karate athletes in the world. He's never competed on the Olympic stage, but he did win gold at the Pan American games. We will of course be following all of our local athletes on air and online as the Olympics get closer. Just stay with us right here on Channel 2. Back to you.